Hey guys, welcome to another lunchtime review. Today I'm gonna go to Rafferty's. I've already ordered it online, so I'm gonna go in here and just pick it up. Okay, they evidently have a um, like a pickup area near, like on the back of this restaurant. So it said I needed to go there to get it. So I'm gonna have to get back in my car and drive over to the carryout section, which I wasn't aware of. Okay, so I guess I got a call. Hey, right, so when I pulled up, a guy was um, outside working on something. Um, actually, he was breaking ice up. So um, he kind of, uh, I thought I was gonna have to call, which I probably would have if he hadn't been out there. And um, so anyway, I didn't have to call. He just went in and uh, brought it out and he said, what was the name? And I said, Kevin, and he, he said, I've got it right here. And so he just handed it to me. Um, so I'm gonna go find a parking place somewhere out of the way. Um, probably in this Meyer parking lot. This sounds good to me. I'm gonna probably go. Hmm. I'll probably go over this way. Yeah. It's a very large bag. I'm gonna unpack it here. Yeah, that's a full on, a full on grocery, it's a full on grocery bag there. Anyway, <laughs> I'm, gonna, I'm gonna get set up. I'll be right back. All right, so here's what I got. First of all, this is a huge thing of fries. I mean, it's monstrous. And then I got the sandwich. This is called a bluegrass. I'll tell you the name of it in a second, but it's basically uh, a marinated, marinated chicken breast with uh, barbecue sauce. You get bacon, you get, um, I can't remember what kind of cheese it is, but you get tomato, lettuce, um, pickles, and mayo. So I'm gonna tell you the name and the cost and everything when I get back. But yeah, this is basically it. Hey, good thing I printed out my cheat sheet because I couldn't remember what it was. Uh, this one is the Bluegrass Special Sandwich. Uh, Rafferty's, by the way, is um, they have locations in Kentucky, Tennessee, and I think one in Georgia. So they're not everywhere, but they are kind of in this one little region. Um, this was the Bluegrass Special Sandwich. It came with the fries or any side, really. I could have got a baked potato if that one. It was $11.99 with tax, tip, or whatever. It was $14.51 total. So that, that's what I paid out the door. Um, so yeah, bluegrass special sandwich. And like I said, it's, it's a, and I got fries. Um, it is a, a marinated chicken breast. It's not breaded. It's just, it's just a grilled chicken breast with, um, um barbecue sauce and a cheese. The fries are these really rough cut skin on fries. Not bad. They're very potatoey, and um, the flavor-wise, they're okay. I can say I wish they were hotter. Like I said, I ordered ahead. I arrived right on time, right when I said I would be there, and um, yeah, these fries feel like they were made probably about five to ten minutes before I got there. If I had to guess, because I mean they're not ice cold, they're they're warm, but they've been under you know they've been under a heating lamp of some kind. They're edible, but they're not great. Um, I also noticed they well they did give me the silverware with the um, napkins to it. I'm just gonna grab a napkin. Yeah, <laughs> gold glove compartment full of them. All right, so let's try this sandwich out. Get my sleeves up, you know, get ready to eat. Okay, chicken breast looks pretty decent size. I like tomato. This tomato doesn't look too awfully pale, so I'll probably try it out. Spread my pickles out a little bit. The lettuce, eh, I'll probably pull about half that lettuce off because it's really, really, really green. Um, lettuce for me just adds a little crunch. It really doesn't add any flavor anyway. I want to drop that in the floor. I'll tell you what, the chicken's pretty good size. Um, you can see how big the chicken patty is. Pretty, pretty decent sized piece of chicken. Um, if I don't think of how to attack, I'm just going to go for it. Well, I'll, I'll make a mess, but here we go. Oh, 
what it looks like. You can see it's a pretty good sized chicken breast. I love, absolutely love the smokiness of it. That is not a, um, that's not a grilled chicken breast. It's marinated. So you can tell there's a, there's a, a coating of some kind on there. Not like breading, but like a, a seasoning, but it's grilled. I mean, uh, not grilled, charbroiled. It's charbroiled um, chicken. So I can taste that, um, that charred, um, flavor you get from a, from a grill, not, um, a grill, a griddle, like it's not fried. I really like that. I like that charbroiled, um, flavor and the bacon's really good too. With this kind of sandwich, you just gotta go for it. Yeah, this bacon, this is my kind of bacon. It's thick, kind of fatty, salty. It's good bacon. That's what these pickles taste like. Just a regular pickle. I don't know if they were bread and butter or zesty or something like that. The barbecue sauce itself has a, um, it also has a smoky flavor. It's not a spicy barbecue, so if you wanted a spicy barbecue, this is not it. Um, but I do have to say it's not overly sweet either. So it's not like really syrupy sweet. It's also not really spicy. So it's kind of a, just a regular smoked, um, like a hickory smoked barbecue sauce. That's kind of what it's like. Um, overall, this is a really good sandwich. I really do like the sandwich quite a bit. Um, the fries, the fries, if they would have been really, really hot, like fresh out of the out of the fryer, I probably would have liked them a lot more. I probably would have given them a four. Since they're really almost room temperature, they don't taste that great. But then again, lots of fries don't. Um, I'm going to give the fries like a three, uh, only because the they're not hot. If I the, Like I said, if they'd been hot, they probably would have got a four. The sandwich, though, I'm going to give the sandwich... Um, I'm gonna give a sandwich a four and a half. I wish the barbecue sauce had been a little bit, a little bit more spicy for me personally, but um, I like all the flavors. I like the charbroiled flavor. I like the uh, um, or the grilled flavor, whatever the little char on there. I don't know what, where it came from, but um, anyway, it's got a little char on it, and um, yeah, it's got it's got lines to it. It's almost like it was grilled though, so I don't know if it was charbroiled or not. But it seems it seems like it was because it has a smoky flavor, but that could be coming from the barbecue sauce. Uh, but I'm also getting that charred flavor, which could have come from a grill as well. Regardless of how they did it, it's really good. I like that flavor. I like the barbecue sauce, which is a little spicier. Beyond that, I think it's really, really good. So four and a half for that, three for the fries. So I hope you enjoy this video. Thanks for watching.